For many years, we've tried to think up a credible story as to how we actually met in order to divert from the truth. The fact of the matter is that no such fictionary tale is yet to come forward that is credible. One cold October evening, my brother, George, Dave Gallagher and I decided to go for a couple of last minute looseners on the way home. George, clad in the world's tightest gym shorts known to man, was our designated driver. A few words were passed and we ended up chatting over a cigarette outside the club. This went on for many minutes until we realised it was closing time. A flutter of the eyelids from Ellen and the bouncy, bouncer happily let her pass to collect her back. He was not, however, so welcoming to me. This took me back to a particular sick form report where my form tutor at the time made the assessment that Peter had a problem with authority. He couldn't have been more right. Ellen got her bag, I got arrested. However, somehow amongst all this chaos, I managed to get a mobile phone number. And the rest, my friends, is history. So who is Ellen? She's family orientated. She's kind hearted. She's open minded and extremely empathetic. She's ambitious, consistent, respectable, honest. She's gorgeous and friendly. She's loving, affectionate, talented and very humble. She's independent and a superb mother to both of our boys. She can deal with stress and carry heavy burdens. She smiles when she feels like screaming and she sings when she feels like crying. She cries when she is happy and laughs when she is afraid. Her love is unconditional and she is a beautiful, beautiful woman. I did not fall in love with you. I walked into love with you with my eyes wide open, choosing every step along the way. I would choose you in a hundred lifetimes, in a hundred worlds, in any version of reality. I would find you and I would choose you. I, Peter Stewart Jakes Mackenzie, take you, Ellen, Emma, Mary, Scarus Brick Miller, to be my wife. I, Ellen, Emma, Mary, Scarus Brick Miller. Take you, Peter Stewart, Jakes Mackenzie, be my husband. To have and to hold from this day forwards. To love and to cherish till death us do part. by my side and the wind in our sail, I know for a fact I will never get a day's rest from self-reflection and ultimately self-improvement. It will take me a lifetime to give back to you what you have so freely given to me. Here's to love, to laughter and our happy ever after.